Hey everybody, it's Andy aka Max Writer. We are back with another unboxing video and today I got a big one. Now this is coming from Things from the Basement LLC from Fairfield, Connecticut. And I know what this is. So, there's a story that goes with this. I think I can cut... Hold on, is this going to expose too much? Uh, maybe. I don't, I don't know. Try to be careful. I don't want to damage the, bo the boxes because I think they'll be just as nice. So, um, I got government money uh, for COVID, and decided I would splurge just just a little bit. And yes, unfortunately, what I wanted to buy wasn't there. So, in a panic, I bought the other one. Only to, uh, and, and I sent a message. I was like, so, when are, uh, when are these going to be available again? And he said, oh, I'm just waiting for these, for the guns, for this. That's so nice. That's really nicely packaged. And um, I had already, oh, these don't come in a box. That's a little disappointing. I thought they would come in a box. That's okay. Um... I guess they're gonna live in this box. What is that? Oh, that's the base. Uh, so, he said, that's what we're waiting for. We should have more available soon. And then when they were available, he contacted me. This is gonna be a short one because these are huge, but we are not opening a sec, except for the way that we're opening them right now. Anyway, uh, so he sent me uh, an email to let me know when these guys are going to be available again. So, again. so this is from Space 1889. It is the... Uh, we've got two airships. Here is the Locust class. Well, that's not... That's not... That's uh, What is this? I'm not sure what that is. We've got the Locust class, and we've got the Aphid class. And here's kind of what it's going to look like when it's done. Now, these are made with the same uh, burnt cut wood. Uh, it looks like... They come with a very solid piece of plastic to mount them on. Oh, nice. Oh, geez. They're coming out of their, the housings already. I wish these came in a box. Um, this is a detailed airship kit for 28 millimeter figures, 156 scale, laser cut 1.6 millimeter and 3 millimeter HDF laser engraved details, removable roof section, removable propeller, um, oh, revolving propeller, magnetized resin, 3D printed armament includes one inch quick firing deck gun and two Nord Nordenfeldt guns. There is a 12 inch clear acrylic ship base included. Um, there's the rod. Where's the base? It might be in there. Oh, here's the card. Okay, I don't see the base, but I'm not, but it's probably, I'm guessing it's in there. Uh, kit supplied, unassembled, and unpainted measures approximately 19 inches by 7 inches by 6 inches. Detailed instructions are available for download. I have those. I I am not going to want to take this out yet. Huh. I don't know what the base is supposed to look like. I'm going to have to guess it's in there somewhere. Uh, and then this one is the um, Locust class, which is another uh, version of the, the British airships from Space 1889. Uh, 19 by 7 by 6 inches. This one has a two, two four-inch quick-firing deck guns, two Nordenfeldt guns, and two rocket launchers. 12-inch clear acrylic rod ship base included. Interesting. I'm not sure what you hook the rod onto. But, here, let's pull out. The aphid's one I really wanted, and the Locust is an official 1889 ship. So... Might be that, and this. Those don't look like they are things that would normally fit on. Anyway, I'm not sure. I'll check the instructions out. We'll see where we're staying. But very, very cool. I'm very happy with these. Man, they're huge. So that's from Things in the Basement. And I think this company is the one that does the guns. Aver class airship guns. Locust class airship guns. So that's it, everybody. That is the 
those are the two that I ordered, and I'm very happy with these. They're going to be, I'm going to figure out how to best paint these and then get them put together at some point. So thanks for watching, everybody. As always, I appreciate it, and I will talk to you all next time.